Hey guys, Kevin Guillen here with Western Hunter Magazine. Uh, here today to show you guys the FHF TAC Mountain Rifle Case. Um, I've actually been excited to do this video because this is one of the coolest products that I've been able to use and uh, test in a long time. Uh, it's super cool and I think a lot of people, you know, maybe over overlook it because it's like, oh, it's just a soft case. But uh, for me, uh, the reason why I got it um, was pretty specific and I think there's a hell of a lot more to this thing that I kind of discovered once I used it for a little while. Super, super cool. I mean, there's a ton of cool features here. Um, first of all, what you're looking at here, these are accessories. This is the munitions pouch that it does not come with. You have to buy this you know, additional. Same with this. I think this is their E4 weatherproof pouch. You can put a number of different accessories on the outside, which just really makes it nice for um, storing a whole lot of different accessories. Um, I put you know, a couple of my magazines here. Um, you can put whatever the hell you want in here. Uh, another exterior zippered pocket, um, small things. I've got like an extra pick rail in here, some, some headphones, um, just really convenient little pockets. One of the coolest things about this um, is the fact that it's made with one inch marine grade foam. Uh, what that really means to you is that it makes this thing extremely buoyant. Not only does it protect your rifle, offer a whole lot of cushioning and padding, um, it kind of has like this hybrid between a soft case and a hard case feel. It's definitely more robust, more overbuilt than your average soft case. But if you're ever in a situation where you're hunting around water, um, you can even use, use this thing potentially like in a, in a duck hunt if your shotgun fit in here. Um, but it definitely will float too, which is, which is pretty cool. It's kind of like a worst case scenario feature. Um, so this is the large size. One of the cool things that, in discussing this with Paul, one of the things that really intrigued me the most that I was really interested in was that the large um, and the other sizes as well will fit. The design was meant to fit inside of a hard case. So we're actually going to Kodiak here in, uh, in a little less than a month. Um, and, you know, so we're going to be flying with a bunch of rifles, but then, you know, you're in a float plane and then you're going to be on a boat. So there's a lot of bags changing hands. And so I wanted to be able to have like a soft case for our rifles once we, you know, get off the plane. This thing uh, is designed to fit right inside that hard case. I'll show you guys that a little bit later, but that's a pretty slick idea and it works perfectly. Um, nice thing. So it comes with these Velcro um, stay accessories. So you can kind of strap your rifle in place. You can strap a bipod here if you want. Um, it's really got this awesome Velcro material so you can use these different attachment points to configure this thing however you however you want um, which is nice you know because if you're going to put binoculars in here or a rangefinder pistol whatever you don't want things to jostle around uh, you, it comes with two and i believe you can just buy more if you needed more but um, it's got a lot of different modularity in that regard um, fits my rifle perfectly so that is obviously ideal one of the cool features um, that I've, I've noticed here recently, like with this new rifle I've got, I've been trying different scopes, trying some different loads. There's been a lot of trips out to the desert to go shooting. So one of the cool things is that the, the zipper, it has this lay flat design. So you can use it as a work surface out in the middle of the desert or dirt or whatever you are, or you can use it as a shooting mat. Um, it just makes it really convenient for, you know, setting some stuff down, ammo, optics, whatever you need. Uh, I really like that about it. Again, all these little things, they just kind of add up to like this super useful, convenient case. Another thing that I didn't really foresee enjoying so much, but there's these pull handles everywhere on both ends and, you know, carry handles, but it just makes it really easy to pull this thing out of the back of your truck or wherever it is. Um, again, just convenience is, is a really nice feature there. It does come with a car attachment kit, so you can basically attach this off your front seat so it's you know your rifle would hang there in the rear i haven't used that yet um, i will use it that way when i put this thing in uh, i've got a, a lexus gx and it's if you guys have seen those vehicles before there's not a whole lot of room in the back so being able to keep this thing off the floorboards and just off the seat or out of the back but easily accessible is going to be really nice uh, it also comes with a backpack attachment buckle kit so you can basically wear this thing as a backpack um, so, you know, FHF really has thought of a lot of different, you know, use cases that guys would benefit from this thing because I think, you know, whether you're shooting PRS, you know, there's a lot of different scenarios where I think one or all of these features is going to come into play for you. Um, so again, the thing that really drew me to this the most though was kind of a novel idea to me. You know, maybe there's been other cases that have done this before, but 
It's designed to fit inside of a hard case. Um, so you just basically take your standard Pelican or SKB case, remove the foam, this thing goes right in there. You've got this rock solid contained soft case, but then you've got a really awesome case when you get out there. So I'll show you how it fits in there so you can kind of just get a sense of what I'm talking about. This is a Pelican uh, 1750 case, pretty standard. Um, I've had this thing for years, flown with it a bunch, put rifle, binoculars, and pistols in here all at the same time. Um, pretty universally like used model they make. Kind of turn this around so you can see. So, you know, all you do, you just remove the foam. This guy sets right in there. I mean, perfectly. In my brief uses of testing this out, I don't think you'd want to overfill these accessory pods. Um, it just tended to make the, the whole fit a little too tight once you have your rifle in there. Um, again, I only have a magazine, two magazines in here, and I have like a little box of a uh, turret in here. So, you know, that might be sufficient, but you know, fits in there. You can open this up, put your rifle back in. I just kind of got in the habit of always locking this barrel in place. So it keeps that front end pretty steady. Suppose you can zipper this up just for added security if you needed to so i mean that thing's not rattling around at all um, i really think it's just a, a pretty convenient setup so overall this case um, i think a lot of people they they look at it online i mean it's a 375 dollar case the 50 inch is however the, their largest version uh, i think it goes down into two sizes a little bit in price um, it is on the higher end uh, cost wise, but I think with what you're getting, it absolutely uh, makes sense and is worth it. Um, you know, not just the fact that this is kind of two in one, you know, it's somewhat of a hard case and a soft case, gives you the functionality to use it in flight and travel. Um, the attachments it comes with is I think an auto, another really nice added value, fully made in America materials and, and manufacturing. Um, to me, there's, that means a lot as well. So, you know, absolutely stoked with this thing. Um, it has really been one of the, the coolest, I mean, it is absolutely the coolest rifle case I've ever owned. And I think it's only gonna continue to show its, its value to me during this like Kodiak hunt um, and probably the rest of the hunts I have this year. So I don't know, uh, honestly, th this thing has been living in my truck back and forth to the office. To the, like it, it moves probably eight to 10 times a, a, a week right now. And uh, I really enjoyed it. So it's worth its weight in gold to me. I highly suggest you guys check it out. You can get it on FHF's uh, website. Um, I believe they just restocked in a number of different colors and sizes, so they should have everything available. Check out these accessories. Um, and if you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments. I know Paul and the team at FHF, they're Johnny on the spot with customer service. They've been really, really awesome to work with. So give them a shout if you have more detailed questions on you know, any of the construction materials or anything like that. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you want to see more stuff like this, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks.